here I am in Daytona and I get still and I am asking this this woman right here what's your muck and you said you knew already what it was well my muck is too much stuff in my house mm. Okay. My muck, and I also have a large family, and I don't have. A, I have about a two thousand square foot house. Then how many people live in your Eight. home? Eight. Okay, so Four that's. Bedrooms. So when you have too much stuff that you don't need, and so you know, I've tried all kinds of different things. I do, I'm doing better than I ever did as my growth as I've gotten older, but it's still very difficult. And how do you control? What are some of the things you found effective for controlling all the stuff? That's a lot of people. Um, I quit going to garage sales. Yeah, that's a big one. No, for I really sure. did, and um, now I just clearance shop. <laughs> <laughs> um, and and I, so I did. I, I found that I would. Oh, this is such a good deal because I'm such a frugal person too. That I was like, well, this is such a great deal, but I didn't really need it. So I found that if I didn't go, then I didn't. You know, it was easier if I just went and bought what I needed, and then you know. Um, and I did use um, the. When I do do a room, I only try and do a room at a time when I do do um, organizing. Cleaning, you know, organizing, and I do like the three boxes were give away, put away, and throw away. Perfect. That, good that job. has really helped me. That where did you learn that but from? It doesn't take Fly Lady. Yeah, she's good. She is. And, um, but it doesn't take long before I have piles again. <laughs> that's what's hard and I think a really important thing and I'm still working on this and I have six kids and the oldest one is 21 is to teach your children how to pick up after themselves absolutely it's really important and take things home yes. as opposed to putting them away yes if everything has a home everything it's pretty has clear to have a home and that's probably that's a big problem for me my husband says that to me all the time I don't understand why you have I have neat piles okay. my piles are neat but he'll say why can't you just put this somewhere it has to have a home but I am limited on space so Lack that, of decision making, perhaps. Yes, you know? it is. Do I really need this? Like, I'm a book person. I love books. So I have so many books. And it was really, really hard for me. I feel like one of those people that was on one of the shows where they um, hoard things, you know, and they mm -hmm. have really. But I know I'm not. But I mean, I love books. And I'm like, but he's like, you'll never read this ever again, probably. I'm like, yeah, but it was such a good book. So I had to learn to let go. Libraries. Libraries are a good thing. And I use the library all the time. So, yeah, so that's what you and do. And I also found that I get um, great pleasure out of giving people things. Like free cycle and things like that. So I start giving things away. Nice. And it feels good to purge those things and give people. Mm -hmm. You're passing on your good, really, whenever you're donating and giving. Yeah. You know, and then it all, it all comes back to you anyhow. Yeah. What goes around comes around. I agree. Which Beautiful. You learned some good stuff. Yeah. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Thanks for watching. Thumbs up the video if you enjoyed it, and don't forget to subscribe for more helpful tips on how to master your muck. Make sure to click, I know you like it, click the like button, go on, you can do it, thumbs up.